We are going to listen to the word of Hallelujah. God. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I want us to read from the book of Genesis. And we are going to concentrate where God visited Abraham. Adam. Where God visited Adam. But the part that we are going to read. It is the one that says here. Cut 3 verse 20. 3 verse number 20. Chapter 3 verse number 20. The rest we will quote because it's a lot of things. And they heard the sound of the Lord God walking in the garden in the cool of the day. And Adam and his wife hid themselves from the presence of the Lord God among the trees of the garden. But the Lord God called to Adam and said to him, Where are you? 18 years. 20 years. You know Adam and Iram from the garden of the garden of the garden. You know the end of the garden 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 of the garden. The man called his wife's name Eve because she was the mother of all the living. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Last week, if you still remember, we spoke about the message. Saying, God, will give the kingship to the king. When he has given him the kingship, if that king goes and does good things, God no longer refers to him through the son of David. He will refer to him as the son of David. And we were looking at what happened. And we discovered that among all the kings that served God in a good way, God will change their God will change their family and he will refer to them as the son of David. Because in their family there will be wrongs that will be identified. Now this afternoon we are continuing when we now read the word of God in the beginning of this, in the book of Genesis God will visit people and he will will visit people continuously. When we read now at the the New Testament, where in the New Testament, even Jesus Christ will Islam visit people. And the word of God said, when he visited Peter, he found that the grandmother of Peter was sick. But I want to show you about the visitation from God. There is something that is there in the visitation from God. And the word of God says, Adam and Eve were in the garden of Egypt. It is said that they heard the footsteps of God. God was visiting the garden of Egypt. When they heard the footsteps, and the word of God said they hid themselves. When we go to verse number 20, Adam gave a name to his wife. And he gave her the name Eve. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Yes, you must see. If I got under when. If I was giving a testimony, he said, my name is called Mulaifah. It is a name that I was given. But the one who gave me the name, name, and he died after giving me the name, and the people that are remaining, when I meet them on the way, the wives of those men, they refer to me as their husband. Because he took a name that gave him from the old man. 
the name there is somewhere where it's coming from vahone. where it is coming from Huna shuma. there is something what that is doing alo. to you the old the name that you are given it has got something that Gaun is only hirao the one who gave you the name lina, lina, una na wanted to do something <laughs> the the name. when they said it they said it purposefully it can be said by my grandfather and they were fighting against my mother it can be said by my aunt while he was fighting against my mother but the name that you carry you will walk with you everywhere where you go it is in your family through that is why when God visits other people it doesn't prosper them it doesn't bless them before he could change their name because that name that that person is heavy it doesn't know with the good things that are there the Gapians as we are sitting here that which is failing you to be seen somewhere it is the name that you are kept how did your name come from you it doesn't matter it is coming from the it might be coming from a Christian but being, but being given by a father who is not a Christian Hallelujah. praise the Lord now God is visiting the garden of Egypt when God visited the garden of Egypt there are so many things he said after saying all those things the word of God doesn't reveal he changing the name of Adam the word of God doesn't show he changing the name of Adam why? Adam because Adam was not given a name coming from another he was given the name but it from the heavenly throne, from the throne of now God. Now and actually, the name that is on the throne, it is a good name. Eva. Eve was not given the name coming from another Eva. throne. She was given the name coming from the throne of God. Eva. Eve was given the name Adam. by Adam. 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 Had no other God. Adam. Adam was created by God. Even this name it was given by God from the throne of God. Now but God spoke to him. He doesn't change him a name because he is there on the throne of God. Now when you are sitting your here, here, your name, your son name, it refers to your family. Your family I tend to such God. It doesn't allow you to go to school. Your family throne. It doesn't allow you to have a family. Your family throne. It doesn't want good things for you. It believes in dead things. Even though you might be educated. You... The, you enjoy the car from your grandfather. You drive the car of your grandfather. He doesn't want you to buy another new car. You stay in the house of your grandfather. He doesn't allow you to build your own house. When you are an agape, you have to change the things of your family. You have to change the things of your family throne. That which were left at home refers your family you have to change it so that it can speak about your name so that it can speak about your son name Hallelujah. praise the Lord where did you receive your name from? from is it not the one that is suffering you where does your name come from is it not the one that is causing as trouble as for you is it not the one that when you walk in people will undermine you is it not the one that is making as you as that as as way way are your leaders as will undermine you is it not the one that makes you when like you walk around you look like somebody that is wrong it is not you that they are referring to it is the family throne that is being hated Adam, 
Adam comes from God. Eve comes from God. When God appeared, it doesn't have a problem with changing your son name. Because that son name is coming from him. When you read your Bible and you go continue when the family of God was you will find God visiting Abraham. Abraham the son of Terah inside the house of Abraham there was a throne that was being worshipped the throne of Terah who was the father of Abraham and God visited Abraham and he wanted to bless Abraham he said Abraham leave this place go away from your family and go to a place where I will bless you there is a place where when you are there, it will not work out. It will not work out for you. It will want you to come out and where you will be able to be blessed. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. And the word of God says, Abraham, Abraham leave your father's house. Leave your father's house. And your father's house. And go where I will be able to bless you with you. In other words, leave your relatives and your the family throne of your father, that of worshipping idols. If there is something that God hates, that God fights against, it's the throne that is in our families. That is the throne of witchcraft. This throne of Satan is there in our houses. It is the one Jehovah. God. He fights against the throne. That throne. That throne that is in our families. When you are seated, you, Mr. Mahasana's daughter, when you are seated, there is a throne of Mahasana family. And don't forget, the son of Mahasana is having so many sons in it. There are so many people that have different sons that have to deal with the throne of the Mahasana family. Until it surrenders, that is when you will be able to prosper. Until it surrenders, that is when you will be able to Because this throne, it has got a large followers. It has got a lot of sons following it. It's the throne of a kingship. It's the throne of being a king. For you to live it, for you to live it, so that you can be out, and you be the other person. You be the other person. That you should become a friend of the other person, but you serve God. You serve God. You serve God. And spiritually you need to be changed and you need to be changed your name from the throne of God that is when you will be able to prosper Hallelujah. praise the Lord because in that place when you are sitting there and you are called by the name that thing should not work for you the thing that abides you, there should be somebody that rises up and say, I bind the throne of my family. I bind the throne of my family. I bind the throne of my family so that it leaves me and leaves my children. So that it can leave my family. The things of my children, it should be well with them. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Listen here. When Abraham had left, after he had left the place, from his father's house, the Lord visited him. When he visited him, God said to him, from today, you will no longer be called Abraham. You will be called Abraham. Why did God change the name? The name Abraham. He changed it. Because from the throne of God, Abraham, the name Aliho is not there. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. The name Abraham doesn't exist from the throne of God. The God wants to bless Abraham. He said to him, When you allowed yourself to come out and you came to a place where I want you, why the family throne of your God is not there? When you allowed yourself to come out, I will now change your name. Your name so that I can write it in my throne. You will no longer be called Abraham. Abraham. But you will be called Abraham. 
Why did it happen that way? Abraham, Abraham means not having any riches. It means not succeeding in life. Abraham, Abraham means not having a child. Abraham, Abraham means not being a king. Abraham, Abraham it means all the riches that is there in the land is yours. Abraham means having a child. There is no medicine. There is nothing that is stopping. That is stopping the Abraham. Abraham. It's Abraham. No, Abraham. Now this Abraham has to leave somebody. So that somebody can prosper. If Abraham can leave somebody, Abraham. and you become Abraham, then things shall be well with you. Your riches you will get. Your children you will get. But it is not easy. It is not easy. Abraham. For Abraham. For him. Things it is not easy. For Abraham. Things should be well with him. But it is easy. Abraham. For Abraham. So that things can be well with him. Today's churches. They are filled with Abrahams. But somebody can pray and say, My God, Abraham. my name is Abraham. But change my name Abraham. so that I can be called Abraham. Abraham. So that it can work out for me. So that in heaven things can work out for me. Because Abraham is not there in the throne of God. Abraham is there in the throne of God. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. That is why even when you call upon God, God cannot hear you. Because you are calling but him Abraham. while your name is Abraham. You are calling him but if Abraham. while your name is Abraham. You need to call him Hallelujah. when your name is Abraham so that it can be well. And the word of God yes, says, when God visited him Abraham. and he was talking to Abraham, Abraham. he said to Abraham, your wife Sarah she will no longer be called Sarah. She will be called Sarai, which means the mother of nations. God calls the, the things that are not there as if they are there. God calls the things that are not there and he will say they are there. When you are seated here this afternoon, call that which is not there so that it can be there this afternoon. Call that which is not there so that it can be there this afternoon. So call like Sarah and say I am not a barren from the work I am not a bad person when it concerns education. I am not a bad person when it comes to success. I am not a bad person when it comes to my health. Don't allow to stay inside this house while you are being buried in the things of life. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Somebody's you, are you hearing me? Is somebody getting what I'm saying? I'm talking to that which is in you. That which is blocking you this afternoon. That which is boosting you. And it is saying that it is seated there. And it is saying I'm possessing my time. That I'm staying in my person. This afternoon. I hold and pull. That which is possessing your blood. That which says it is called Abraham. I hold and pull. That which is in somebody's mind. That says I am Abraham. And I'm saying in the mighty name of the living God. I put Abraham inside that person. I am putting inside that person. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Where you were born, where we come from, will no longer be like what we are going to be like. Where we come from, it means getting everything through struggling. Where we come from, it means taking everything through struggling. But this afternoon, you can say, my God, change my name, my God, change my surname, so that it can mean good That surname of yours, it will have to prophesy good things to you. That which you are sitting for here, that which you are thinking of you are here, it's going to happen. But the God that we are sitting here for, Abraham. he is the God of Abraham. He is the God of Sarah. He is not the God of Sarah. He is not the God of Abraham. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. 
Look at what is happening behind you. Look at what is happening in your family. Look at what is happening. Others don't even know what is happening. They just feel like this is the That is not the life. This afternoon, that life that is in you, young it has to be changed. That life that is in you, young girl, it has to be changed. You will no longer be the last of the apple. You will no longer be the last of the apple. You will no longer become the topic of gossip, of being gossiped. You are going to change and become Abraham. You are going to change and you become Sarai. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Flamed him, Larry. The word of God says, while he was living, God visited Jacob. Jacob is the daughter, is the son of Sam. Our God is amazing. When he visited Abraham, he changed things. When he visited Jacob, he changed things. Jacob, Jacob, is the son of Isaac. God is appearing to him. When he appeared to him, he found this lady that Jacob is didn't come the right way. No, he wants to bless him. He wants to bless him. This young man Jacob, when he comes, he finds the name. And it is in the family throne. It is coming from Wayback. From the grandfather. From from Laban where they worship idols and when God appears he said Jacob I cannot bless you when you still have the name Jacob because in you, you there is no good things that are attached to you when I look at you if you go to an interview you will not pass because you are still called Jacob when I look at you when you are at school you will never pass because your name is still Jacob. When I look at you, when you are at your workplace, you will not work well because your name is Jacob. Your name means about your future. When we are seated here, your name, it, it predicts your future. When you are seated here, your surname, it means about your future. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. If God comes and starts to deal with the throne, when he discovers your name being written in your family throne, he will change the name and says, Jacob, I want to prosper you. You will become a rich more than other people. But it will be impossible. You will have to change. When I change you, 12 children. Jacob doesn't have 12 children. Jacob Jacob doesn't have 12 nations. But when it is changed, it brings nations. 12 nations. Jacob, Jacob I will change it. You will no longer be called Jacob. You will be called Jacob. Israel. Israel, which simply means 12 nations. When he was changed, Jacob, Jacob he had children, many children. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Why? Because his name it is there in the heavenly throne. It will not be possible until God will change something. Until you will speak with God and say, My God, I want to change this name. Of mine, so that it can mean good things. This name of mine, so that it can mean good things. This name of mine, so that it can refer to good things. There are so many names that are different here that doesn't refer to good things that are suffering your children. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. But that name could be there. When it is there, this afternoon, Yehovah. And you are saying, God, I am it. Even if I'm called Jacob, change my name from your throne so that it can refer to good things. Those who call me through Jacob in my family throne, it shall no longer work anything because your name that is called Jacob, even though when they are praying to their gods, they will mention it. Even when they are praying to their idols, they will speak about it. They will when they are seated, they, they will be surprised. 
they will speak and say. When we give him the name, we didn't think that he will prosper that way. When we give him the name, we never thought that he will become a pastor. When we gave him the name, we never thought that she will become a teacher. When we gave him the name, we never thought that she will become great. But this one is troubling us because his name is there in this throne. Not this afternoon. We'll have to change the name of somebody. Black it out from the family throne and it will remain Hallelujah. in the of God. Praise the Lord. Lord. It has to be well with you. It has to be well with you. It has to be well with you. Be well with you. If your family is not a family of succeeding, if your family is not a family of getting married, if your family is not a family of getting married, if your family is not a family of getting educated, you can shout this afternoon and say, God, let education come to my family. Let education come Yo, to my family. God, let good marriage come to my family. In my family. Let good things come to our family. Let good things come to our children. Let them be jobs in my family. Let them be jobs in my family. Let good things come to our children. Let them be jobs in my family. Let jobs in my family. Let them be jobs in my family. Let jobs in my family. Let them be 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 jobs in my family. Let that is when something will be seen. It has to change. If you can say, Jehovah, God, I don't no longer want to walk with evil people. I don't want to walk under the counsel of evil people. I want to walk being counseled by your throne. This afternoon, there might be whatever that you are crying about. I am saying to you, that this is the time of prayer, of receiving. This is the time of raising up your hands to God and say, my God, I am receiving that which I deserve. Change that my life change my name so that it can reflect good things to me. Let us all stand up on our feet as a church. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Somebody should receive something. You know where you are coming from. You know where you are coming from. When we are going to speak with God, we are going to start by rebuking. You rebuke the spirits. The spirit of Sangoma that is your family. You rebuke the spirits. The spirit of Machoma that is your family. You rebuke the spirits. The spirit of Machoma that is your family. That started way back. And he received now following you. They are saying you also have to perform the rituals. You have to go to church fire these things. You have to go to church fire these things. In the afternoon I say, the spirit of the Lord will have to leave somebody. The spirit of the Lord will have to leave somebody. The spirit of the Lord will have to leave somebody. The spirit of the Lord will have to leave somebody. Will have to leave somebody that person should confess and say, I serve the Lord. Even this afternoon, we are going to pick up a song in the name of Jesus Christ. We are going to pick up a song in the name of Jesus Christ. As we pick up the song, and we are singing. Song, we will go to the time of prayer. We are going to speak to God. Everything that is stopping you on the way, this afternoon, we will have to leave somebody. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Let's hear a song as we are singing. Yehovah, the Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want.
Bazi tiba kuine zwa kurunoni ya habo. Bazi tiba kuine zwa mutani wa habo. Bazi tiba kuine zwa ndia koti habo. Zite yo valicheza. Zite yo shandu uka masiera tuwala na musi. Nga zina la manda. La iso kristo wa nazareta. Kala imzele zonda ntabati kwa rapela. Lari yo vandu unea mbilu ya anga. Yo vandu unea mbilu ya anga. Yo vandu unea muya wa anga. Shandu kisa kumbrele kwa anga. Shandu kisa ndivo ya anga. Shandu kisa plene zanga. Nga zina la manda. Laiso Kristo wa Nazareta shandukisa Yehova shandukisa Yehova shandukisa mwe mketwa shandukisa 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 zwa mwe mutu shandukisa zwa mwe munna shandukisa zwa mwe mfumakadzi shandukisa zwa mwe mutanga shandukisa mwe mketwa nga dzina la manda laiso Kristo wa Nazareta Flamu tumliri kuna mafungo denene watamandi chusolvera. Ndiya pio mafungo. Amusanda na. Ama polisa ni na. Aka department na. O tula gai. Ndi mini se wali ndela. Yesu se wali ndela. Singabasi ma polisa ni. Singabasi ka msimu sanda. Singabasi ka department. Chena chiri ndela masiera tupala na musi. Chite au ni pindura. Nite ya wana pindura ena zili ndela. Hapo po zifaro bako to dilengisa. Mutimwe ino ndufuno wa polona zote. Mutimwe ino ndufuno vizela kagara zote. Zoba fanera bone, zoba fanera. Zoba fanera bone samuwa gape. Zoni fanera ini samuwa gape. Zoni fanera ni chinga ima. Na vizelela yehova. Mutimwe gape, mutimwe mwa apostola. Na muparo fita mauna. Arali banga mu vizelela bari. Nanga masiera dubala na musi. Ndo ima fano wa gape. Niri hezi azongo mfanera. Asongo bafanera bon. Confirmation ze wadziwana petu opamba na nao. Asongo bafanera bon. Kaba ziane ze masiara dubala na musi. Kaba anete confirmation ze wadziwana zine tisabe zon. Kaba ambe na zonga zine laiso kristo wa nazaret. Kaba ambe na azo. Kaba ambe na azo. Kaba ambe na azo. Then I saw Christo and Nazareth. Kabali bwa mzima ngavali taduru taduru. Bwana bwa mzima mwenye bantu tuzote. Bwa mzima na sapai dunga chitu mre. Bwa mzima mwenye kon. Bwa mzima mwenye vile raita sato bon. Kabali bwa mzima ash. Kabara ber. Basi tiba queen ne bon, basi tiba queen, basi tiba queen ne zamta wa hawa, basi tiba queen ne zandu ya hawa.
Let us give the Lord a hand of praise. Still standing on our feet as we are. Standing on our feet as we are. I will ask the ushers to help these people in the front to stand up. Pastor Makesha will be coming, then we will pray for them. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. As these people are standing like this at the front, come closer. I want this person who has a name Lamufu. of a dead person. I am not referring to somebody who has got a name of somebody that is still alive. The name that you are called with, you were given that name by somebody that is already dead. And it refers to that person. Person. You cannot live the life of In another another person. You have to live your life. There is nobody who has to live twice in this and world. Who has to live through somebody? If you have a name that they call you with, and you were given that name and that person died, that gave you the name. Please come to the front. I want to say a prayer for you. Let's all stand where we are. Can you wait a moment? Listen carefully. For it to work out for you. And so that you should not just waste your time. I am not saying somebody who has got a name. Of the person who has a name. That you were given by somebody that is dead. And that name is of that dead person. If this person is called Chinakaho, listen carefully. If this person is called Chinakaho, and they gave this name to their grandchild, and they are no longer alive. This is the child that will come here. If they gave you a name, and you are called Mususume, and their name is Chinakao, then you are not coming to the front. Did you get what I'm saying? I want the person who has a name that is that is given a name by Chinakao. And the name that you are given, you are called Chinakao. And this person called Chinakao. If this person called Chinakao, who gave you her name, is still alive, then don't come to the front. Did you get what I'm saying? We have to grow spiritually in such a way that we understand and so that we should not say God does not know. Now here, Chinakao has to come out from the grandchild. Are you getting what I'm saying? That is what I want. I'm going to pray for you on that. The ones that were here at the front should stand in the front line. The one who came through the altar call stand in the second row. Don't come to the front line. And don't come for another person. Come only for yourself. Don't say, I am going there for my child. It will not work for you. Hallelujah.